There's been some rumors going around about Antonio Gibson possibly being trade bait. And, uh, you know, what what do you feel about that? Because, honestly, I think Antonio Gibson is much needed here in Washington. While we are finally getting uh, Brian Robinson uh, back and into the groove, um, I still think that you're going to need somebody like Antonio Gibson as a change-up type of back. Yes, we got J.D. McKissick. Um, Williams is going to be out for some time, could be out the rest of the year. He got hurt uh, a game or two back, and so now you have three backs to, to look at. And I really think that Antonio Gibson being trade bait, I don't know if I'm buying that whatsoever. Um, I do want to buy, of course, William Jackson III being trade bait. Um of course, William Jackson III is denying that he wants to be traded. But there were some rumors going around uh, recently where William Jackson said that he was unhappy, wanted to be traded somewhere else. Now he's coming out denying that. Um, personally, if I am going to trade William Jackson III, I would trade him maybe straight up with another, another cornerback. Um, or possibly, if it is true that the Washington Commanders are indeed shopping and Antonio Gibson, then maybe both of those guys are some sort of package deal and maybe even a draft pick. I don't know for um, some solid offensive linemen, some some great offensive linemen, but the thing is you just don't see offensive linemen just being traded during midseason, at least not very often. And that that's honestly what the Washington Commanders re- really need right now are offensive linemen. And if you don't have that, then it's very hard to go and pluck quality offensive linemen from other teams because guess what? They're playing. And honestly, you need depth. And teams are not going to be so willing to give up that depth for an offensive line unless they truly need guys in those skilled positions like a running back. You know, and Antonio Gibson could be a great player for anybody. Don't get me wrong. Um, but, you know, it's going to be very hard to trade him, I think, for an offensive lineman. I think possibly maybe you trade him for a cornerback uh, or somebody like that. Maybe you trade him for a linebacker if there's a linebacker out there who is unhappy. Um, we've already seen um, uh, McCann. I just went blank here. We've already seen Christian McCaffrey uh, get traded to the San Francisco 49ers. I, I was really I was really kind of surprised by that move because it looks like the Carolina Panthers are going to do a fire sale right now. Obviously, you know, with uh, Matt Rule getting um, fired, you know, now they're just looking to dismantle that team, and I think – completely rebuild that team is probably the right thing to do. But in the case of the Washington Commanders, I don't know. I think that you hang on to Antonio Gibson. Um, but certainly if you can get any type of trade value for William Jackson the third, trade him off. Um, maybe do a swap for another cornerback somewhere else. Uh, but I don't know. What do you think in the comments section? Do you think that Antonio Gibson's going to get traded before the deadline? I'll be very surprised if he does. Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking it, uh, commenting on it, sharing it with your buddies, and most importantly, subscribe to this channel. Let's help to rejuvenate and rebuild this channel, and I will see you in the next one.